Music is said to be the food of soul. Music has significant effects on your psychology and behavior. A type of audible sound wave, music can be vocal or instrumental in origin. Sound waves of music have a characteristic harmony and certain patterns of frequencies and amplitude that your mind finds pleasant. Your choice of music is a reflection of your mentality, behavior, motives and emotions. That explain the difference in your track lists at workout place and a morning walk. Music is deeply interrelated to various human behaviors. These behaviors include music listening, performing, composing, reading, writing, various supporting activities or even simply the tapping of feet. Musical training has been shown to aid memory. Research suggests we listen to the same songs repeatedly because of musical nostalgia. One major study found that music enables the mind to evoke memories of the past. Music form different types of memories in different regions of brain. That's why a person with Alzheimer disease who forgot the notes can still play a complex piano. Musicians have been found to have more developed anterior portions of the corpus callosum. There is a strong correlation of musical exposure before the age of 7 and a great increase in the size of the corpus callosum. The fibers of corpus callosum join together the left and right hemispheres and indicate an increased relaying between both sides of the brain. This large relaying across many different areas of the brain contribute towards music's ability to aid in memory function. According to the National Institute of Health, children and adults who are suffering from emotional trauma have been able to benefit from the use of music in a variety of ways. When pleasant note are played, cerebral blood flow increases in brain regions such as the amygdala, orbitofrontal cortex, ventral striatum, midbrain, and the ventral medial prefrontal cortex. Many of these areas are linked to reward, motivation, emotion, and arousal. Nucleus accumbens, a part of striatum, is involved in both music-related emotions, as well as rhythmic timing. When unpleasant melodies are played, the posterior cingulate cortex is activated, which generates a sense of conflict or emotional pain. With the introduction of widespread digital distribution of music through Internet since 2000, sales of recorded music have dropped off substantially. The ultimate platform of 21st century music is changing due to a greater availability of faster and cheaper Internet. People have begun to prefer listening live broadcast, soundtracks, and streaming from media websites, rather than downloading or buying them from online music stores. However, live stage music has seen an ever-increase in importance.